Both Number teams are lining up for the kickoff. We're just about set to get this one underway. He sends it. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Now he tries to buy some time. And he's going to be sacked. Well, I think the linebacker here does such a good job of disguising his blitz. As a linebacker in college football, one of your biggest responsibilities is being able to get to the quarterback. And that time, he timed it up perfectly, was able to get through the offensive line and put the pressure on the quarterback. Man left, man left. From their own 20-yard line, second down. It was a great play call. It was very well executed. Any coach would be happy with that kind of outcome on a first or second down play. Boss is out to the tailback on the screen. Brought down right around the 28-yard line. The D sniffs out the screen pass and holds him to a short game. Contain, contain, contain. That's the only way you can shut down a guy with 4-2 speed. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. The Cougars, in talking with them this week, Kirk, it's just interesting, their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself, and I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'll be shocked if they can slow him down. Second and 10. Ball on the 27-yard line. He's back, but he can't hang on. Him hard at the 18 yard line. Fourth and long here after the sack. It's away and it's a booming punt. And he's taken down at the 42. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Tailback picked up seven on the draw. That makes it second and two. So the option keeper will get him a first down. It's a very well executed option play. The blocking was there, and the quarterback made the correct decision to keep it himself and get the first down. Tackle at the 33. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. the 29-yard line. Number 50 brings him down. They're going to try a long field goal here. That'll bring up fourth and five. Cincinnati could take the lead with this field goal. The kick is away. It's long enough. And he nails the long field goal. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. 
He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And down he goes, right around the 36-yard line. This secondary better tighten it up if they're going to slow down this drive. First down. Throws it away. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 36. Let's go. Green 19. Green 19. He fights forward to about the 36. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. They'll bring him down around the 27-yard line. Looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. Short yardage situation, and the offense is in the jumbo package. You love having this kind of weapon. You already know what kind of damage he can cause in the passing game, and here you can see what he can do when you hand the ball off to him. And he tackled around the 19-yard line. That's good for a game of five yards. That brings him second and five. That's a great tackle at the 31. Third and long now after the sack. Room around the corner. He's pushed out of bounds right around the 30. Houston is looking to tie things up. Kicks up, and he splits the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, this has really been stingy by both of these defenses. And the question is, can they keep this pace up, though? I think that that's a big challenge for them to be able to continue to play like this. Right now, the emotion of the game is favoring the two defenses. But I get a feeling it's a matter of time until one of these offenses starts clicking. Set, down, hey. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. like a shot. This guy has some big time speed. He tackles him for a loss. That'll bring up second and From their own 45-yard line, it's second down. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Quick pass. He's knocked out of bounds at the 47. Five wide. He scrambled. And they make the stop at around the 44 yard line. That's a game of three on the play. That'll bring up fourth and one. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. This 
one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. Well, this is just a defensive battle so far, Kirk. Well, it's a combination of a couple things, Brad. I think the defenses are playing well, but I think the offenses at this point are making it a little bit easier for them. So let's see if these offenses can get it going a little bit to try to challenge these defenses. We've played one. 3-3 three, three tie. Back to the action here in the second quarter. It's been a good one and a tight one at this point. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Fires quickly and it's picked off. He's taken down at the 17. Good job to pick that ball off. He did a great job at getting in that passing lane and coming away with the ball. First and 10, ball on the 17. Caught over the middle, tackle made around the eight yard line. push by the line and a really nice run. That'll get you into the end zone almost every time. And he adds the extra point. A short three play, 17 yard drive, and they get it in for seven. Cincinnati, yet set to kick this one away. He kicks it off and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Houston's coaching staff, I've got a thing going into halftime, and we're getting close right now, Kirk. They've got to do something different. What they had planned with their star running backs just not working today. Well, I think the continuity between a coaching staff and a quarterback and an offense is tested. Uh, their, their star players not having a great game. They're losing this football game. I think now as we're close to this half, now's when you start to think about what other ways can we attack this defense. And then maybe eventually we get back to our star running back. But in the meantime, let's try to find some other ways to attack to be able to put points up. Here comes the pressure. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he's taken down at the 46. First down. Picked off. He telegraphed that throw. He eyed his receiver the whole way. That was an easy read by the defense. From their own 17 yard line. First down. Cincinnati up seven points. And he tackles him hard at the 20 yard line. Gaining three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Mike's 50, Mike's 50. Let's go. Throws it out. Oh, he's hit hard for a loss. Call it a loss of seven yards on the way. That brings up third and ten. Third and ten. Ball on the 17. Mike's 50. Mike's 50. Watch QB drop. Run! He heaves it deep. Right down. And about the 41. Quick out 
to his receiver. And he shoved out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. You know that saying, get your keys out because we're on a drive? Well, this offense right now is on a drive. I mean, this is their third first down. They're doing just about anything they want, and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. Cincinnati is up a score. Good game by the tailback of about seven on the option play. Tenth play of the drive. Three down, three down. Hey, check back, check back, back six, back six. Let's go! Red and green! Gets to about the 17 yard line. So it's fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. Heading for the corner. Makes it to the nine. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. Two minutes to go in the half. The Bearcats taking their first time out of the half. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Now he's scrambling. Tackle around the two yard line. And again, they're going for it on fourth down. Defense will take the field, hoping for a better result than their last drive. And I don't think this defense will lay down lightly. They're going to try to continue to rattle this guy. The offense is going to try to open this field up, coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. Fires out to his receiver. First down, 10 yards to go. All on their own 40. Houston's going to have to use their second time out of the hat. A pickup of four on the play. You don't have to throw it deep to have success. Any sort of completion can help boost an offense's confidence. He guns it. Makes the grab, and he's knocked out of bounds. Big play right there. Good looking play there. I think they did a great job up front here, allowing the quarterback enough time to look downfield and spot the open man. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 28 yard line. 51, Mike. Mike 51. Hey, that QB's trapped. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. 
They'll make the sack. Well, I think the linebacker here does such a good job of disguising his blitz. As a linebacker in college football, one of your biggest responsibilities is being able to get to the quarterback. And that time, he timed it up perfectly, was able to get through the offensive line and put the pressure on the quarterback. Great job by the defense at getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 18. Here's a screen pass, gets it to the back, and they hit him in the backfield. Kicks away, and it's good! We're halfway through, and it's been a good one. The Bearcats in front by 11. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Steve Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. This team's now got a hill to climb in the second half. We anticipated it being a tight game, but as you watch this team late in the half, you started to see guys looking for answers. You could almost sense it. They were looking at who's going to take ownership, who's going to lead and make a play. Somebody has to step up right now, Dave. Yeah, no doubt about it. When you come into games, you, you feel like you have this huge game plan and all this stuff you want to accomplish, and sometimes it doesn't work, and sometimes you got to start changing things around, and sometimes it's simple. Sometimes the quarterback needs to come in the huddle and say, hey, guys, you want to protect me a little better? You know, you they need to say some things that, that makes people feel uncomfortable sometimes to get a rise out of them and knowing your team. Sometimes middle linebackers have to get the defense all in tight and say, listen, you need to make sure you're taking care of this. They've been killing us on this route. It's your fault. Step up. The leaders in the huddle a lot of times can say the things that the coaches can't and get a different reaction. Well, maybe it's time I say something to you, too. It's time for you to pick up your game at halftime. That'll do it here in the studio at halftime. We'll try to see if Pollock can bring a little energy in the second half. Got a lot of games to watch, including yours. Brad and Kirk, ready for the second half. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Everywhere we go in college football, everybody's got a T-shirt that says finish, finish. Whether that means finish the game or finish the drive. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. they got to execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. Throws complete. Big loss. So it's second and 14. Ball on their own 21. And he's immediately tackled. And he's tackled right away. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Let's do him again, complete. I'm a huge fan of the play action pass in college football because the play action it really puts a lot of pressure on defense. The defense gets caught up and concerned about the running game, and it puts them out of position, and it makes the throwing lanes for the quarterback and the windows that he's trying to find much easier to find for a quarterback and the receivers to pick up big yards like we just saw there. From the 39-yard line, second down. Let's go! 
Slings it quickly to his halfback again. And they push him out at the 38. is a one possession game with this kick right here. He gets it up and he just drilled it from long range. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone down for a touchback. Here comes the offense as they look to find the end zone yet again. Three down, three down. Cincinnati check, check. holds an eight-point advantage. Set, check, check. Let's go eight. Set. He's on the run. He's tackled around the 28-yard line. pitch it he's to the 40 and he's tackled the 47 yard line Sticks. I think that's the third time he's carried the ball in this drive. And I can imagine they'll keep giving it to this guy until the defense can figure out how to stop him. Easy, easy, easy. Hot. Hands it off. He makes it to the 38-yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. That brings up second and nine. He tackles him for a loss. The defense just met the blockers head on and drove them back straight into the runner. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 29. Cincinnati is up by eight. And he hits him hard at the 46 yard line. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. He found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. He's going to try to cough and corner this one. It's away and it's a booming punt. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And they make the stop around the 29-yard line. That brings up second and one. Four down, four down. 51, Mike. Let's go. Red AC. Red AC. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Call it a gain of five yards. Hey, we got time right That makes it first and ten. Four down, four down. Mike 51. Mike. Check 99. Check 99. Tackle made at the 42. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it second and two. Mike 51. Mike 51. They'll bring him down for a loss. 
finish on the play. It's third down and five to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. Just throws this one away. And they're going to have to bring on the punt team. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. Everybody up close. It looks like they're coming after this kick. He really got a hold of that one. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. Their last drive resulted in a punt, so let's see if they can put together something a little more promising here. Cincinnati up by eight. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. That'll make it second and four. He's taken down at the 40-yard line. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. He makes it to the 42-yard line. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. And that was the sophomore linebacker there who was able to get in and make that tackle. Side in the fourth. 17 9, Bearcats. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. He scrambled. And they get the sack. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 40. Cincinnati holds an eight-point advantage. Ready! Great concentration to haul it in. Touchdown, Cincinnati! And he adds the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. Cincinnati's defense has really been impressive, especially these last couple of drives. Well, now you start to think about how this team has played defensively, and what it's done is set up their own offense with really good field position to give them a chance to be able to extend this lead. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive, and they had to put the ball away. Fires that quickly incomplete. Second and ten. Ball in the 25. And he just gets rid of it. They come out in a five wide set. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Down at about the 31. <laughs> Boom. 
booming kick. Tackle made for the 38-yard line. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. No game. That makes it second and ten. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. Going long. That close to being intercepted. Number 10 breaks up the pass. That makes it fourth and eight. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. And he's tackled at the 30. He showed a good burst there. We're about set to start things up again. I'm, I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. Quick shot with the tailback and through his hands. Well, he had his hands on the ball, but once the hit arrived, there was no way he was going to maintain possession. From their own 30-yard line, second down. There's a strike complete. Tackle right around the 38-yard line. Number 20 with the tackle at the 38-yard line. That'll bring up third and two. Catches it, and he's looking for more. He steps out at about the 41. Gain of three yards. First down. Less than three minutes in the game. And down he goes at the 49. That's a gain of 10 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Out of bounds, right around the 42-yard line. And a pickup of about seven. Hey, they picked up a nice gain of seven yards on that play. Great pass. Swings it out left to the halfback. He's tackled at the 42-yard line. They come out on an empty backfield. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. That's good for a game of 10 yards. First down. Here we go. Easy, easy, easy. Sting run. Fires out quickly to the tailback. And he's tackled at the 22-yard line. Call it a gain of 10 yards. That'll make it and this is the ninth play of the current drive. And he just gets rid of it. Well, they'll line it up again on third down. Two for two so far on this drive. Here comes the pressure, and he throws right away. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. And this is the 12th play of the drive. That makes it second and 10. Roger, Roger. Go on, Mike 51. Just under two minutes in the game. Here we go. Black 90. Black, black 90. Pass complete and taken down immediately. Easy, easy, easy. No, sir.
quick. He's got another one. He gets hit out of bounds at the five. The offense gets a first down here. you got to give him some credit. But really, this is more about the defense. When, when a defense gets an offense to third down and medium, you've got to be able to put pressure on a quarterback, especially when they're passing the football and trying to get Throws to the receiver. Got it for the touchdown. The quarterback stays on the field as they try for the two-point conversion. They got it. So with just over a minute to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, 24-17, Cincinnati. They'll bring him down at the 43. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. He gets out to about the 42-yard line. A one-yard gain by the halfback. From the 42-yard line, it's second down. On the ground, and he won't get back to the line. Two-yard loss for the halfback. Houston's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Defensive stand there. And some good play calling defensively. They always had someone in the right spot to make a play and force to three and out. Just over a minute left. The punt goes out of bounds at the two-yard line. Houston staff right now has got to be thinking what the defense is looking at and what they're going to be keying on. Well, the defense is going to be looking at this running back. They're going to put everybody that they can to be able to stop him and not allow him to make a, a big play. That means the offense is going to have to be able to find somebody else maybe on this drive ready to step up and maybe become the hero to be able to win this game. Get to that quickly. They'll bring him down at the 15-yard line. Reception. That makes it first and ten. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. That's a great tackle at the 25 yard line. And he stops the clock with a spike. It's third down, and they're about the length of the football away from the first down marker. I love the toughness here by this quarterback of sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield, only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. Well, you can talk about offense all you want, and they were good today, but the defense was better. They come up with a play of the day, and that'll lead to the victory. The whistle hasn't sounded yet. They still have to snap the ball and make sure they don't make any mistakes. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. Takes a knee. From the 27-yard line, it's second down. Cincinnati is up seven. The offense lining up in a victory formation, and he takes a knee. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, 24-17, Cincinnati. So that wraps things up for us. 3A Sports and Kirk Herbstreit. I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you next time.